A WWE wrestler was gonna kill Paul Heyman on live TV. Tommy Dreamer was the heart and soul of ECW, but during his time with the company, he turned down much better contracts with WWE. This was due in part to the owner of ECW, Paul Heyman, persuading Tommy to stay. When ECW went out of business in 2001, Dreamer was left without a job and forced to live with his parents. Dreamer also learned that Heyman had secretly been getting paid by WWE for years. Even worse, Tommy was told he was gonna make his WWE debut at WrestleMania 17, but plans fell through. This put Dreamer in a very dark place, and he got a hold of a gun. His plan was to go to WrestleMania 17, jump the barricade, shoot Paul Heyman, who was doing commentary, and then turn the gun on himself. As he was contemplating all this, Tommy Dreamer got a call from a number he didn't recognize. He let it go to voicemail, and the recording said, Hey Tommy, it's Jim Ross. Just want to let you know we are still thinking about you. We are going to get it done. Just got to hang tight. Thank you. This is all Dreamer needed to turn everything around.